1936, Spain was divided in two due to a civil war. On the one hand, the Republicans, and on the other, the Francoists. A few years later, after the success of the Francoists at the Civil War, a 40-year-long dictatorship began. With Franco at the lead, every decision was made by him. Education would not be an exception. The ideology of the far right was so radical. Education was used to indoctrinate young people with their ideology. As one of the first measures, half of all the teachers were executed just because they were Republicans. The education was absolutely limited by the Francoist and Catholic ideologies. Every classroom had Franco's photo, a cross and the Virgin Mary. The teacher's table was at a different height, showing superiority above the students, whose desks were not able to move. Before starting their class, there was a clear routine to follow. Students were separated depending on their gender. After that, they would pray to God and, and sing Cara del Sol, a Francoist hymn a complete indoctrination. The role of the teacher was clear, authoritarian, standoffish and cold. The only function they had was to tr transmit the students the fascist and Christian principles. Only basic knowledge was taught. The methodology was based on learning by heart. Students were supposed to be polite and obedient. If they weren't, a punishment was the usual reaction. Usually these punishments were physical abuses, like flogging them with a ruler or punching them with a ring. They were also forced to hold books in their hands with their arms up high. These punishments, apart from physical efforts, were supposed to humiliate them in front of their classmates. The curriculum in this era was being restricted in order to promote the growth of students as citizens of the Francoist state which was being created. The curriculum and syllabus value was getting lost for society in general. Today, education has another reason for being. Education is known as the starting point of a well-taught and educated future society. Principles and values are shown from childhood. The curriculum has evolved and so has the syllabus. Nowadays, education is supposed to be public, secular and apolitical. However, education is getting more and more difficult given changing social conditions. These days, the variety between students is high. We have racial, cultural and social diversity. The fact is we are far from achieving our goal. The teacher training is changing and so is their role. These changes allow us to see the light at the end of the tunnel.